Hello everyone and welcome back to a blind let's play the quarry for the PS5. We're in chapter this is seven. An education. Watch. About a month or so into the past, learning more about Laura and Max here. Hope you're all having a wonderful, fantastic day today. I'm Fatless Bird, and this is your Soybeats Gaming Channel. Nice job cleaning up the eye. I mean, it's harder than they make out in the textbooks, especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor. Uh, animal doctor. And no, I'm not. And I probably never will be stuck in here forever. You know, just because you know doesn't mean you know. You know? Uh, what? I'm not. This isn't what it seems to be. You're gonna have to be more specific. You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. My family? We didn't mean to hurt anybody. We're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Are they the progenitors? Not really. Like the beginning? They're the ones that are cursed? We're gonna end this thing once and for all. We? Is progenitor the right word? I think so. Yeah. Curious, how is your family involved? Confident, let's end it. Ah, oh, both great choices. I wanna know more about the family. So, how is your family involved? My family... ...is down at the bottom of a well. Chair starts to ease up. What? Family is the most important thing in the world. But if your whole family... ...you know, like... A Every last one of them decided to jump down the bottom of a well, and they're all just hanging on the end of a rope. How can one person be expected to pull them all back out? You can't. I don't you get it. on that rope, and you're just going to fall right down to the bottom of the well with the rest of them. And what's the point of that? Right, so you, you're the one at the top of the well with a rope, and... Yes. I thought that was obvious. Yeah, okay, yeah, I got it. Just forget it. Let's see how smart you really are. Okay. What are you giving me? What is this? Information. Well, what does it mean? Read it. When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. Shuns water. And should you yourself be cursed, Armed with silver and the first. When moon is full before its wane, rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your blight or fear the dread of full moon's light. Yeah. Keep reading. So if we cut the head off the snake, it all stops. Um, no, no, we're okay right now, I think.
head, if it's a bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. Starting to get the picture. It's not a lot to go on. And frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? <laughs> I don't know. But it's all we have to go on. Kill the werewolf that bit you and you'll be cured. It has to be silver. It has to be full moon. Seems pretty straightforward to me. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big F. I just want to cure Max. It's not as straightforward as you think. So it is a werewolf, just not the werewolf that I thought. Uh, confused, why didn't you kill it? Concerned, am I, I'm, hmm. I was wondering if we were infected because we got gouged pretty badly, but it said a bite, which means you had to get bitten in order to be infected. Confused. If you knew all this, why didn't you just kill it in the storm shelter when you had the chance? It's not so, I, mean, I, I was, when I- Straightforward? No, yeah, it's so not, you... they're not so easy to hit. I was trying to protect you too. Yeah, at the beginning, it wasn't firing into the shelter to kill Max. It was trying to fire at the uh, the wolf. Cynical, I don't believe you. Encouraging. Encouraging. So what's the plan? Well, that's where I'm hoping you'll come in. Me? Yeah. Because your studies. I haven't even started. Well, you're the best option I got. I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? Maybe it doesn't matter because maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. Look. If we do this. to think about all this. If we do this, we see Max. Seen enough? Question is, what was Max watching? I don't think I'd believe a word he just said if I hadn't. If I hadn't seen that. He's probably watching footage of himself transforming. Bet you anything. Resigned. I believe him. I mean, I believe him. I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about the werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty line kidnapping cop, Laura. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. I understand, but I think he's right. Well, fuck him. He's had his chance to fix this. We're getting out of here and we're gonna fix it on our own. I really don't think that's a good idea. Hey, Laura? Yeah? I saw what happened. What I did to your eye? Yeah. Is it bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm so sorry. Empathetic? It wasn't you? Resigned. It's not like you're in control. It wasn't you. I know it wasn't you. I know. But it was. We're gonna fix you, Max. I promise. I promise. 
but we got to get the alpha. You said let me in there. Chris, I know they're in there. Who? The townsfolk that didn't show up. Why don't you find out? Bobby told me. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. A while back, I, I worked out the rest. Shit. Why? Why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here? That's fucked up. Fucking bit one of them, Chris. What am I supposed to do? You bit one? Wait, you bit one? Me. I'm telling mom. Thank your lucky stars it wasn't silver. What's your plan? You can't keep him here forever. I'm handling it. Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? If I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You ever think of that? That was all Bobby and Caleb. And you those know hikers? And that, that, that fucking journalist? Damn it, Travis. What are we going to do now? Whatever happened to... We're all in this together. Shit, man. Let's go to my office. We shouldn't talk here. So that was Max. 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 at the beginning oh. in the cellar. What is it? Travis was just in the hall talking, the cop. So? With Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. He's a werewolf. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. Holy shit, that's... Who would have guessed? So what I are mean, they trying I to do then? Thinking about it, I could have... Are they yeah, trying to kill it. the original it werewolf? makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter because it was his fucking brother. God, it's so obvious. Not so if, obvious. If Chris was the one that bit me, then you need to kill Adam, Chris. That's our cure. That's how we fix you. Jesus, Laura, are we thinking the same thing? Tomorrow we're getting out of here. I'm gonna get Travis's gun. And kill Chris Hackett. But do we hey, need to kill hey, help her. Chris or do we need to kill the Laura original? Help. Laura? Laura, are you okay? God damn it. Injection oh, needle? On. Laura! Yep. Bam. You know what they say about turnabout? Oh. Fuck. It's a precision jab right there. It's a good shot, Laura. Starting to think you were really sick. Well, maybe I should consider acting as my major. I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> we should go before he wakes yeah. up. I'm so curious though, do we need to kill Hackett or the original werewolf? Because maybe that's why Chris was locked up. Because they were trying to hunt the original. The Alpha. And if we just go on a murdering spree... We should grab our stuff. We need silver ammo. He must have some around here. And what is, is up with this voice? I thought I heard someone. Someone did this to me. No, I, I still can't. 
What is this? What is calling out to us? It's coming from behind that door. He hears it too. They, the Hackets, did this to us, the circus people? But how are they whispering like they are? There's nobody in here. What the fuck? He makes them. What is it? Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last month, hunting. And he wasn't hunting his brother. Well, I guess he won't be needing us anymore. Because his brother was locked up in the cellar. Hey, I just realized something. We're free. <laughs> Not yet. Anxious. Not until Chris is dead. Reassuring. Ah. <sighs> We'll give him false hope. Hell yeah, we are. That's two months we'll never get back, but for now, we're one step closer to going home. And when is that? Tonight. Going to Hackett's quarry, and we're killing Chris Hackett. So I don't think killing Chris Hackett's going to do it. We either need to get rid of the curse by killing the original werewolf or we need to get rid of the curse by doing something else that I haven't really figured out yet. And I made my way here to a camp. Left but it, Max at the island seemed like the best place for him, surrounded by water and all. Oh god. Max is the That's one who it. killed Emma. That's the story. Oh my god. And I'll jump in at the same time. No way! Wait. The island? Like, like our island? Like the one in the lake? Yeah, why? Because Jacob, he went back there looking for Emma and he hasn't come back yet. Neither of them has. Oh, God. Shit. Honest, they're not there now. Reassuring, they're probably fine. Uh... We don't know that. We'll just be honest. Well, if they were there, they're not there now. What's that supposed to mean? Don't make me spell it out for you. I've just come back from there and there's one werewolf and no people. Oh, fuck. All I know is I have to do this. I have to kill Chris Hackett before it's too late. After you saw me at the pool, after I shot Chris, um, I went back to the island expecting Max to be back to normal. But... You know, you really should have left Max in the cell. Because if you had, Emma would be still be alive. And I think the island would be the safest place to be right now because it's surrounded by water and the werewolves can't get here. But she let a monster in what would be a safe Max? place otherwise. Hello? 
These are some freaky looking werewolves, by the way. Those things are so weird looking. I really like how they changed what you think of a werewolf. So the werewolf I killed can't have been Chris. That wasn't a werewolf. It was Kaylee Hackett, Chris's daughter. Whatever I shot, that was no girl. Unless, I, I guess, it turned back after I shot it when I went to the island. Wait, so how come Max didn't kill you then? Show by she got pinned? He tried. I got away. I need to end this. We don't have much time. Well, considering Abigail died because we didn't pull the trigger, maybe we should? Just saying? Who the heck are you? So this is our new guest. Smell good, don't I? Go on, take a bow. Go on. Dumb fucking animal. Okay. Let me go. Let me fucking go. Get your hands off me. Well, back to Jacob. Pleading, threatening. Uh, he's pleading right now. Please let me go. Okay. I need me for this to happen, please. Please. Oh my God, why aren't you answering me? Sound like calling oh, the cops oh, gonna help. Oh. Is your is your money that you want? Cause, cause my dad's got money. Like lots of it. How are you? I mean, not really, but you could get some, probably. Please, <laughs> just let me go, please. I'm so sorry. Oh, Jesus Christ. That's too, Bobby. I hate to say it, but that's probably the safest place it can be. Hey! Hey! Hey, where are you going? Hey! Hey! Providing electricity doesn't go out, of course. Because then it would definitely not be the safest place it can be. Yeah, they're almost like a cross section between what a vampire would look like and a and a werewolf. Brilliant design. Where's that at? A cellar? Oh, hello. Nosy little rat, aren't you? Poking your nose where it doesn't belong. 
Don't believe everything you hear. Anyway, here we are again. Let's see what you've brought me this time, shall we? The chariot. Only one card. The chariot. At the reins of a chariot, we would all feel safer. Taking control, relying on determination to make our choices. Valiant. But in some cases, foolish. Many seek refuge in chariots. But perhaps in some cases, they're not as safe as we think they are. And the same question as always. Will you let me show you more? Yeah, it hasn't really helped us so much, but you know what? Sure, why not? I've always said that I feel like these premonitions help more after you know what's going to happen than before. But by then, they're too late. But I still love them so much. You'll be seeing me a few more times before the night's over. I look forward to that, as long as you follow the right path, of course. I think I've gone way off the right path by this point in the game. Oh, boy. Oh, man. All right, the end of Chapter 7. Before we jump into Chapter 8, let's uh, look over our choices, shall we? Uh, Laura and Max, see if there's anything new here. Uh, Laura was sympathetic to Max of his rejection letter. Laura is supportive of Max during the imprisonment. About the law, Laura's honest with the cop about the exit on the road. Laura didn't try to take his gun. Laura used a syringe on Travis during her and Max's escape. You see, the, the tarot card, I think, had you taken his gun. But we were able to get out without having to take his gun. The question is, is that a good thing or a bad thing? The White Whale. This is an interesting title. Uh, consumed by obsession. Yeah, uh, that makes sense. When the chance to grasp all you ever wanted means sacrificing all you ever had, do you take it? Laura did not shoot Travis when escaping her cell. For good or ill remains to be seen. There's still four more paths that we haven't unlocked. And there's a good chance we may not unlock all the paths. If you remember, I think it was Man of Madon. There was one path that we never unlocked during our first playthrough. I think it was Man of Madon. I know it was one of them. Uh, Freak Show Fire clues. Uh, all right, we got a new clue here. The fire of Harm Skarm six years ago took the lives of many and is rumored to have been arson. No wonder it made the front page. Ah, shoot, sorry about that. I always press the wrong button. I press uh, circle to go back. Uh, old photo. C. Hackett and T. Hackett. Chris and Travis. They're brothers. Oh. I should have realized that. T. Hackett. Yeah, I should have realized that. Uh, why is this... Why is this question mark here and it's highlighted but nothing's there? Could be a bug. The game did just get patched. Or maybe something else. Scroll Limerick. Uh, this doesn't paint a particularly favorable picture of Sheriff Hackett. Perhaps this is the first time he's locked someone up illegally. Bizarre yet bona fide podcast. Um, we saw that. Anything new? Counselor's Ledger. Lauren Max were kidnapped by Travis and Chris. Tried to hide it by not reporting that they didn't show up for camp. Again, another one of those I think they just may be um it just may be a glitch or a bug it happens did we find new evidence no that was a previous chapter all right let's look at this tarot card one more time shall we the chariot okay so it's Dylan, right? Dylan and Caitlin open up a gate. Okay. Chapter 8, The Belly of the Beast. We are Ryan. 
Where is Chris Hackett? Shut up. What a rude. Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. Commanding, I said shut up. Uncertain. Caitlin, what do I do? Uh, Caitlin seems to be the alpha in our group. Let's let's go to her. Uh, Caitlin, what do I do? Oh wow, real strong showing on the leadership front. I said shut up. <laughs> Oh, no way. I am not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. Look, just think about everything that's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. I'm convinced. All this over a poem? Curious. You said a woman. Ah. Ah. I'm, I'm both. I am curious. Hold up. You, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? Because we've been hearing voices. What do you know? Guard it. Nothing just podcasts. Honest. Just reminds me of a local story I know. The hag of Hackett's quarry. A woman in the woods. They say that she died years ago. And now she sort of roams the darkness waiting for her lost boy. These guys hate it when I talk about it. You've seen her. No, I don't know, but I heard this thing back at the police station, a, a podcast. The Zarya Bonafide? Yeah, that's it. It looks like Travis was keeping an eye on it. Why? Maybe it's more than a story. Look, Truth all and I can fiction. tell you for sure is that whatever's happening at Hackett's Quarry runs deeper than you know. I'm just gonna go right ahead and take that back from you there. Why do you just let her to take... What are you doing? Why would you just give that back so, to her? Come on. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. She's bitten. She's a problem. Mean. I don't know. What makes you think I know that? Uh, you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here? He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. Dude, sure. What? Let's go to the spooky house. Sarcastic. Have you thought about not killing him? Compassionate. Listen, there could be another way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? Don't forget about Nick, dude. Okay, any closer we're gonna spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh, yeah, what they said. I'm sorry, I keep confusing Nick with Dylan. It's Dylan that went through the gate. Uh, friendly. Chris has nothing to do with this. Aggressive. No way you're going alone. He, he is someone who... He is someone who has been Chris's, like... Chris's guy, right? I'm gonna show you that Chris Hackett has nothing to do with this. He wanted us to stay inside tonight. He wanted us safe. I don't care what you think. I don't care what you think. <laughs> Shut up. Fine. Do whatever you want. You saw what happened to Nick. He was bitten. Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole. Where is it? ditched in the lake why it was a stolen cop car you're gonna have to try and fix the minivan get somewhere safe how Can't long do you have fix it an hour or two i don't know it doesn't seem like an exact science then we better get going can't fix a car because the rotary cap is gone Are you sure this is the right way? Pretty sure, yeah. 
Pretty or definitely? What do I look like? A tour guide? Oh, well, Laura. Suspicious or inquisitive. <sighs> She's very suspicious. This doesn't feel right. I think you're up to something. I'm not. You better not just be running out the clock. I'm not. The longer we're out here, the longer we're in danger. Said the murderer. You know, it might be a lot more pleasant if you lighten up a little. What is wrong with you? Defensive. Sincere. These two don't get along. Nothing. And if it makes you feel any better, I'm not a murderer. You murdered Kaylee, and you want to murder Chris. I don't. I want to save everyone else. He's infected. Except Kaylee, right? She would have killed you all if I hadn't shown up. You must know how insane this all is. Ryan does not agree. Yeah, no, duh. There it is. Hacky house. So he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there, but... His mom. If we're looking for answers, it's probably the best place to start. I would say his mom uh, wait, is how do we get there? the alpha, but she... What do you mean? How do we get to the house? She wasn't a wolf. She was a woman. That's a really good question. Maybe we just don't. Angry? Compassionate. Ah, oh, this is tough. Uh, like I said, they don't get along. Will you stop? protecting him whose side are you on at this point i have no fucking idea there is a lot more to this than you realize like what kidnapping murder cover-ups i think the whole goddamn hackett family is in on it maybe the whole camp maybe even you for all i know yeah great just walk away oh i'm sorry i just figured that instead of standing around listening to you complain i'd actually try to find uh -oh. another way across Fuck. Uh, that's gonna leave a mark. Laura? She's starting to turn. She feels it. We, we could have died, but we didn't. It's nothing, you'll be fine. And you don't look delicious to me yet, so I guess that means we still have time. Come on, let's find a way up. That's not funny. It's a bit funny. No. It's. I, I'm sorry, Laura, but. Oh my god, Laura! Jesus, Mary and Jazz hands! Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax, look. Oh my god. What big eyes you have, Grandma? No shit! Can you see yellow in my eyes? Yeah. Define yellow. Shit. We haven't got much time. Uh, can we uh, have an option to take that gun to your temple and just fire right now? Because I've already lost people because I was too compassionate. I think I titled that my last uh, part, Compassion vs. Survival, because that's how I felt. I'm losing lives because I'm doing what I hope is the right thing. 
Okay, Emma wasn't crashing or survival. It was just stupidity. But I didn't expect that. This must be part of the old working quarry. Makes sense. I mean, I didn't expect there to be a werewolf on the island. Especially with what I know about werewolves now. You know, there, there, there's no reason that should be there. Okay, well, that's got to be a bug. Because the letter is completely dark. I noticed the termination, dear valued employee. I regret to inform you that your service at Hackett's Quarry will no longer be required. It is my intention to return to the site of the Central Quarry. It is my intention to return the site of the Central Quarry to an area of natural beauty by flooding it and allowing a lake to form in its place. You'll be paid until the end of this coming week and then asked to vacate the premises. I'd like to thank you all for your continued loyalty and wish you well in your future endeavors. Yours faithfully, Septimus Hackett. Type bastard just can't pay us. Last time I trust a hack it. So what if it's not about the circus? What if it's about the workers of the quarry? And what if this Septimus guy? Uh, the Septimus is the one we need to kill. Oh, I'm telling you. I, I love how we know things. And yet at the same time we don't know things. It's like we're getting answers, but with each answer, we're getting an additional question that we haven't answered. It's brilliant storytelling. This game is amazing. And I just really hope that in our next two playthroughs, we'll see enough divergence uh, to make this game really, really shine like House of Ashes shown. Because I thought House of Ashes was the best game. Did you hear that too? So far. It's her. Who? The hag of Hackett's quarry. It's like she's warning us off. Or guiding us. And yeah, I think if I were to rank them so far, now this is just me shooting from the hip. I haven't given it a lot of time to think about it. But I think House of Ashes is the best game followed by Until Dawn. Oh, shit. And then maybe, I haven't decided the last two, that? but. No, they can't have done. They're all great. This place is not up to code. It's just a matter of I mean, ranking them as hard. if the code is literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. Let's just keep moving. Quickly. Considering your condition. Careful. Jeez. Can we not give her the gun, by the way? I mean, that's the only form of protection if she goes, you know, Wolfie. And, and can we not have her be the one that's... Oh, hello. The lovers. Can we not have her the one that's trailing Ryan? Can Ryan trail her? Just look at this place. Oh, Almost missed that. I could really do with a hamburger right about now. Stop being weird. Yeah, stop talking about food. I also like how the cards are like out of place in this game. You know, you have to walk at a certain angle and hit X. It's not something like you walk oh over to boy, and you pick it up. I... Whoa. I like when they do things that are different. What's this? Do you think actually something is in here with us? Oh, that's gross. Either that or this route isn't as disused as we thought. Oh, that is gross. She just picks that up. Oh. Really hope she doesn't just start nomming on it. I might lose my lunch. A long way down. I haven't even eaten yet. Cave in. Do not enter. Well, where's cave out? <laughs> Look who's finding their funny bone.
this way. Take the railing first. So what's your deal then? What do you mean? The whole mysterious brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. So I don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? Uh, patient inquisitive. And what box would that be? Nothing. Forget it. Do you always do that? Do what? Uh, start to engage in a conversation and then just immediately recoil into your shell. Maybe I don't want to talk to you anymore. Oh, wow. Charming. I am assuming you're single? Yeah. Why? No reason. This way. I see a light. Yeah. Or you can just hang out here. Up to you. Wow, Someone's she does that. Their spinach. Yeah. So, you want to go into the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or shall I? Oh, hello. Two cards back to back. Don't think I would expect that. Looks promising. It's a wine cellar. This is it. This is the place everyone's being held captive. I don't want to go that way yet. I want to try to see if there's anything around here. There's something. Careful. Splinters. Thanks. I'm fine. Guess we found the party. Alcohol. And prohibition. These are rum running tunnels. That would make that liquor almost a hundred years old. Probably still good. Good. Try vintage. Well, I guess the hackets were bootleggers. That makes sense. I guess when the quarry shut down, they branched out. Come on, time travel later. Wait, let's pick that up again. Just wanted to double check. You think this is it? Uh, beach me. I'm pretty much completely lost. <sighs> yeah, me too. Shall we? Caitlin. You haven't been Caitlin enough. Uh, what happened here? Eh, it's complicated. Gosh. I used to think this place was so cozy. This place, really? Yeah, it reminded me of a ski lodge. Sounds cold. <laughs> but you've never fantasized about being trapped on a remote ski resort in a snowstorm? The cable car is broken, and you've only got each other for warmth. And when the food runs out, you've only got each other. It's quite an imagination. Weird fantasy. <laughs> Optimistic or defensive? Optimistic. <laughs> A ski vacation does sound pretty nice right about now, though, huh? You ever been skiing? <laughs> Don't know the first thing about it. Couple trips down the bunny slope, you'll get the hang of it. Well then, we better get this van up and running then, huh?
Well, let's see what the damage is. Why did they expect someone to jump out of the car? I mean, the wolves are well, aren't they just gonna sit in the back seat, no fix. like smoking a cigar or something. Okay. Can you fix it? No. Oh. Not without some parts, specifically a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the road. Oh, really? So you can fix it. Well, no promises, but if there's hope, that's where we're gonna find it. I thought we were screwed. Sounds like a long shot. Mean. Uh, encouraging. Dylan, come on. Look, I need you. We need you. Fine. Okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. Dylan? Yeah? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, I'm starting to dislike you. <laughs> like I care. <laughs> I like Dylan. I like all these characters. I really do. I'm not just saying that. Like, and until dawn, you know, there's some discussion about one character in particular, and I frankly didn't care for it at all. Um, but in this game, I kind of really like all the characters. Although I would still play the an Until Dawn remake in a second. Absolutely. What was that? Huh? What was Love that? Love that game. Oh, it's nothing. We got we got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands. I could house basement. Keep it down. You keep it down. Why are her eyes not yellow? Is that just an oversight in the uh, in the developers, or do they make her eyes not yellow for a specific reason? Oh, hello. No, 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 no. Was that three cards now? How are we supposed to look at three cards? Well, we're gonna play the game three times, right? Did I just go a back way? Yeah, I did. Oh, hello. Oh, really? Four cards? Yo, that lady better let me look at more than one card. And uh, Dylan and Caitlin, the uh, the previous card, that was us opening gate, right? We know that they're together. So the next chance we get. With them, we should open a gate. Careful. Okay. It's coming from a bed. Jacob. Hey, it's Ryan. Jesus, what happened to you? Looks like he's in shock. I don't blame him. That would be me. Uh, yeah, definitely open cage. Wait, Ryan, don't. No, don't open that cage. Oh. I didn't mean to open that cage. I want to open the other cage. Jeez, man, what are you doing to him down there? Well, that's nothing. We're just keeping him safe, just like we've been trying to do all damn night. What, what was that? Fucking hilarious. Hey, shut up. Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy. Dude from the woods, he used that. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Ma, 
Uh, <clears throat> it's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. The boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got to screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. No. No, no, not my granddaughter, not my only granddaughter, not my Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, you goddamn piece of shit, not my little Kaylee, God damn you, what did you do to her? This woman's about to go psycho. Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? Let's talk more. Um. Yeah. Wait. It's him. Think about it. Why would they lock him in a cage? And who the hell is it? Who the hell is she? She's in charge. You've already got it wrong once. It might even be Nick. Your friend? Hey, listen. Okay. They said that they've already got two of us accounted for. Whatever that means. Whoever this is, they're, they're not going anywhere. Remember? We've got to be sure. You promise? Yes, we do. Fine, fine. You gotta get me out of here. Okay, seriously, man. They took it. They took it. You fucking idiot. Ma. God damn it. You fucking piece of shit. Get away. Get away from me. Help Jacob. Help him. Absolutely. Okay. Left is always right. Okay. okay. Talk me through it. Okay. So, all I know is you have to open my door and that door. And definitely not that door. Yeah. Oh, cool. Thanks, Detective. Okay, fuck you, man. I'm trying to help. No, fuck you. I'm trying to help. Shut up. Shut up. Okay, there's a console on the wall over there, like a box or whatever. You should be able to use those switches to isolate each cage. Okay. Hang tight. Okay. Um, two and four. Uh, two and four. Got like a split second look at the thing. I don't know which one's which. Continue. I can do this. I can do this. Focus, dude. Focus. I need to go back and look. Um, one. And four. Dude, nice. All right, now don't fuck it up. Continue. Um. Two and three? I'm gonna get us all killed, aren't I? Oh, fuck! Dude, shut the fuck up! Okay, what the hell is wrong with you, man? Me or him? Shh. Oh no, we couldn't get him out. Uh oh. Yes. Uh, yeah, call out. Hey, let her go. Hey, Ma! Send Bobby down. Her beauty is a tiger. 
Shoot. Her beauty is inside her. That's why I need to find the key tonight. When I say yes, you say no. Well, there is a reason a redemption run exists, my friends. Really messed that one up. Shoot! Dang it! Welcome back. Did you miss me? Hopefully, you brought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we? Well, at least I know that the werewolf out and it killed everyone. I mean, that's a plus, right? The Empress. Look at her. <laughs> Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters only to live long enough to watch them kill you. <laughs> but it's no less than she deserves. The lovers. There's harmony and disagreement brought to light only by sparks of passion. Blood flows from the heart. You can almost taste it. And tasting it could save someone's life. The Wheel of Fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle-eyed can tell where it's going to stop. The Emperor. Authority, paternity, stricter designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall, and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rot. Details. See more. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness. And watch carefully. Try and find some clarity in the chaos. Really? You gotta choose one of four? Uh, which one? I don't know. Left is always right. So either the Will of Fortune or the Empress. Um. Uh, any meaning? I don't know. Uh, let's just go with. Let's go with the Will of Fortune. Spin that wheel round and round. Let's see where it goes. Oh! Oh my god! Go. You still got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. A, a lot of things just happened in that scene. Chapter 8, Trophy Earned. Whew. Alright, pass. Uh, let's see if there's anything new here. No, okay. Team building. A friend is need is a friend that bleeds. Teamwork makes the dream work, but the dream soon turns into a living nightmare. Uh, Dylan and Caitlin went to the scrapyard to find a working vehicle. Love's labor's lost. Huh. Till death to us part. Secrets can make you feel trapped. Perhaps a kind friend will free you from your guilt. Just don't forget there are worse things lurking in the dark than lies and deceit. Was this a Shakespearean like play that like the last play they worked on before he died or something? I, I don't know. I don't know the full story. I'll have to look it up later. Ryan decided to free Jacob from the basement. Ryan could not figure out the cage doors because Flat's bird's an idiot. Jacob remained in the basement. I'm sorry, Jacob. I like you so much. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to look this one up later. It's bugging me. Um, not not the game, but like, 
Uh, I could have swore I heard Love's Labor's Lost from, um... Oh, I know why these are like this now. Because there's an extra clue that, that we unlocked, but we never unlocked the original clue. Ah, I understand. I understand it. The folks behind the Bizarre Yet Bonafide podcast were onto something. Ah. The Forgotten Belongs of Quarry Miner, abandoned in the tunnels, a letter for closure within indicates it's been down here since the 1930s. I think it was, what, Doctor Who that had love favors lost in one of the episodes uh, with Shakespeare? Maybe that was it. Uh, scarred flesh evidence. A lump of wood appears to be damaged or scarred flesh. Um, these seem to be chronological. One, two, five, six, eight. So every chapter, there's a piece of evidence. Y'all see how that works? So I'm missing three, four, and seven. Again, there is a reason the redemption run exists. Uh, excavation site. Through the main body of the quarry was flooded and transformed into the lake you see today. Some of the excavation tunnels that run below the outskirts of the camp are still intact. The ground above these tunnels is compromised, but don't worry. We'll make sure your kids stay out of your harm's out of harm's way. Disclaimer off limits to asbestos will be reprimanded. Hackett House. The ancestral home of the Hackett family for many generations. Disclaimer this property is off limits to trespassers will be reprimanded. Hackett Scrap. Another successful family enterprise, Hackett Scrap, is situated just away from the summer camp. The proceeds from this lucrative scrap scrapyard, along with your fees, allow us to keep the camp running to such a high standard on an annual basis. I wonder if Abigail is dead in the picture. So this is like Septimus, and we know that there was a Hackett named Septimus. Um, no, I don't think it's showing her up as being dead. Tarot. Ah, uh, still a lot of tarot cards. Um, Wheel of Fortune. All right, well, let's spin the wheel, shall we? Who was it that just snapped? Okay, so someone snapped. Don't know who it is. I guess we can assume that was Laura. And then she went all wolfy. We had a chance to shoot her and we didn't. And because of it, Travis died? Oh boy. I don't know. We're going to have to find out next time though, my friends. I love you all so very much. Thank you for everything. And uh, yeah, until then, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you would like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. Please be sure to like and subscribe for more. Also, please do not forget, you matter. You are brilliant and you are loved. And you should always remember to be true to yourself. Don't let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly feathered flightless bird. Till next time.